Pete Cowan has taught many of the top players in European golf over the last 20 years. Between them, his pupils have over 200 worldwide titles, and he's been giving us an insight into their games. Today in the spotlights, it's the resurgent three-time major champion, Podrick Harrington. A great bloke to work with, fantastic, because he always wants to get better and he wants to understand. And, you know, I mean, Bob Torrance did an unbelievable job with him, fantastic. You know, I mean, three majors. Full of praise for the work that Bob did with uh, Corey. He is a work. He loves hitting golf balls. You think VJ loves hitting golf balls? This guy loves hitting golf balls. 2011 asked me to help him understand his golf swing a little bit better, so I did. 2012 was very good, excellent. Probably should have won either the Masters or the US Open that year. He was in contention for both. 2012, he had a fantastic long game. He understood it, and I, it was my fault, really. In 2013, you know, he'd had a great year, Tita Green. And when you look to the stats, he was probably, I think, the third most effective Tita Green player in that year, 2012. And I, 13, I said something to him at Abu Dhabi, actually, which I thought would make him even better. But it actually went the wrong way. So sometimes, and I've got to blame myself for that. There's no doubt about it. It took us a bit of a while to get that back. Obviously, towards the end of 14, when um, he won in Indonesia, it didn't matter whether it was an Asian Tour title or European or American, he'd won. So all of a sudden, he mentally thought, you know, I can do it. I've been over to uh, Ireland a few times with him. I was over there on Monday this week. And then we saw him at uh, the Honda, uh, which he actually eventually won. And on the Monday and Tuesday, uh, he's there Tuesday afternoon, he says, found something mentally, not, nothing technical, mentally, that allowed me to free myself up and play better golf. So I'm going to take that forward this week. And he says, I think I could win this week. And me and Ronan were looking at each other and thinking, it'd be nice to have a good week. <laughs> but he says, I think I could win this week. And of course, by the end of the week, I'd watched him. And he played fantastic down the straight. He really did. Bunker players improved massively, but he's always been good. His chipping is fantastic. Imaginative, wants to understand a little bit better about the technique, although his technique's great. I've always said his technique was great, so he want, but he still wants to get better, which is the mark of, you know, a champion. If he thinks right, he's great. He'll admit that most of his mistakes are mental. Still trying to improve, still trying to get better, still trying for that 30 yards extra that is in there somewhere. And he'd sacrifice an awful lot for 30 yards extra, would probably, that's for sure. He'd probably give his right arm for 30 yards extra, would probably. <laughs> 